everybody, Crystal here at the Fibromyalgia Pain Chronicles, Veteran Voices for Fibromyalgia, and the National Alliance of Fibromyalgia Advocates, here to bring you Fibro in Five, where I take a topic related to fibromyalgia and I break it down in five minutes or less. And today's topic is about what kind of doctor or specialist should you see to treat fibromyalgia. So whew, this one is a bit of a tough one because no specialty in the medical world has been officially designated for treating fibromyalgia. Um, part of it is is that they do not know like the etiology or cause of fibromyalgia, but they do know it's a central nervous system disorder. What I can tell you is a lot of people tend to and choose to either go see a rheumatologist, a neurologist, a pain management doctor, or a pain medicine rehabilitation doctor to help them treat the myriad of symptoms of fibromyalgia. So with that said, what happens a lot is a lot of individuals with fibromyalgia rely too heavily on their primary care doctors or general practitioners. And one of the issues with that is while these are medical doctors, licensed medical doctors, they are there to help promote your overall physical health and then help identify if something is going on to, you know, order some tests, kind of figure it out and then send you to the right type of specialist. And what happens is I find a lot of people with fibromyalgia tend to stay with their primary care physicians or general practitioners and then get frustrated because they're not really feeling like their doctor is listening to them or coming up with uh, a variety of suggested treatment options or thinking outside of the box to treat fibromyalgia. So at that point, I always recommend that you ask for a referral to either a rheumatologist or neurologist along with a referral or consultation with a pain management specialist doctor or pain clinic or a pain medicine and rehabilitation doctor. The reason being is because um, in this day and age, primary care doctors and rheumatologists, neurologists, they're not going to prescribe uh, typical pain management relief med medications. And that's why you need to be seen and referred to a pain management doctor, pain clinic, pain medicine, rehabilitation doctor. Um, because those are the type of specialties that will be able to try a variety of treatments. Ugh, so my dogs are trying to ruin this video here. <laughs> um, so those doctors, such as pain clinics and pain specialists, are the ones who can uh, try a variety of treatments to help reduce your pain levels with fibromyalgia. A lot of times, uh, many individuals have informed me that their primary care, their general practitioner, rheumatologist or neurologist has refused to put in a referral for a pain management doctor. My recommendation at that point is to become your own self-advocate and first, if they refuse to put that counsel or referral in, ask them to document it in your medical record that they are refusing to refer you to a pain management doctor or clinic to help you manage your pain symptoms. The other thing you can do is if they continue to refuse is you can file a formal patient complaint either with the patient representative or patient advocate. And the reason why you can do this is that you are afforded the right as a patient to receive appropriate and timely treatment for your medical conditions. And when it comes to fibromyalgia and other chronic pain medical conditions, it is completely appropriate to be referred to either a pain management specialist pain clinic or pain medicine and rehabilitation doctor to help you come up with a treatment plan to manage and reduce or minimize some of your pain symptoms. So there you have it. While there's no designated um, specialty to treat fibromyalgia overall, 
I highly recommend that you do not rely on your primary care physician or general practitioner. Ask for a referral to a rheumatologist and neurologist and then for managing your overall pain levels, request a referral to a pain management doctor, pain clinic, or pain medicine and rehabilitation specialist so that you can work and come up with a treatment plan to treat your pain symptoms. So I hope you found this video helpful despite the quick interruption from my little dog. And um, if this was useful or you feel like it might help someone else, please like and share. And until next time, take care of yourselves and ta-ta for now.